Hey, it's the Big Dave Show, and welcome to our virtual field trip number 21, and we're ready to go over to the Villa Hills Police Department today, and along with uh, an officer, Officer Winning from the Ellsmere, Ellsmere, Kentucky Police Department, we're going to show you a couple of our police canine dogs and see them in action, uh, finding illegal substances and also um, attacking our friend Statman in the bite jacket, the big thick suit. It's a lot of fun. Both of the dogs are named Onyx and uh, we're gonna have a lot of fun. And uh, Statman and everybody else and Officer Dooley uh, from the uh, Villa Hills Police Department will be on a little bit later on here after the video to show you uh, and answer any questions. So uh, let's get going here. Let's have us a field trip to the Villa Hills Police Department. Here we go. Hey, it's the Big Dave Show, another virtual field trip, and this time, well, he's the unofficial mayor of Villa Hills, <laughs> resident staff man here. We're here at the city building and police department, and today we're going to learn all about canine officers and, and see them go through the motions. In fact, they're not only going to attack stat in the dog suit here in a few minutes, <laughs> Um, we're going to come in here and we're going to hide some illegal drugs in here for the dogs to come and sniff out. And we're going to see if we can hide them where they can't find them so you can see actual police work from these dogs. Awesome. This is going to be so much fun and we'll learn a little bit about what the dogs go through to get to where they are today. Stan, are you ready to put the suit on and get attacked? I am ready to make a proclamation in the mayor's seat that <laughs> all school is canceled for the rest of the year. <laughs> this is the mayor's seat right here. Unofficial mayor, not uh -huh. real mayor. Well, we'll have fun anyway. So oh, Officer Dooley, we, we've got Onyx here before she attacks, or he attacks that. Oh my goodness, you've got a toy and he's not gonna rest. You got some basic, basic, uh, just obedience. basic obedience. Um, obedience is the foundation of what the dogs are basically are trained on. Uh -huh. If you do have a dog that won't listen to you and you don't have control of, then you can't work it. Uh, the dog has to be 100% obedient to you in order to be able to control him. Uh -huh. So some basic uh, obedience that we do with them. Um, a lot of their obedience is a foundation of German Schutzen work is what they call it. Uh -huh. um, so he basically, but. Are you Biffle. speaking German? Bus. German, yes. Bus. Wow, wow. What Bus. are you saying in German? Bus is a heel command. Bus. dog uh, onyx is really ready to get out look at that yes that was impressive let's 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 what does that mean what stop down down yes now officer dooley uh here, here. Does Onyx only respond on those commands nope. to your voice? It's only me. He won't listen to no one else. My so, wife and kids try, and can I try sometimes some you can try it. I'm prosed it. <laughs> prosed. Yeah. That's not not interested. <laughs> You're lucky he didn't attack you then. <laughs> one cool little trick. Out. All right. Closer. 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 <laughs> Nine. Nine. <laughs> so Walking backwards. He's not even touching him. He's doing it on his own. That's so funny. Oh my gosh, this is great. Hey! He is. All right, so uh, we've met the dogs now, Officer Dooley. So uh, what do you got there in your hand? We've got some illicit narcotics that the dogs are trained to alert on. Um, I'm going to let Stat and Dave and Chelsea hide these throughout the room here. Um, Officer Winning and his canine partner are going to come in, and the dog will find where the narcotics are. No matter where we... No matter where you put them, the dog will find and them. And can you tell us what you have there? Um, this is going to be heroin cocaine and methamphetamine and where did you get this um we're assigned narcotics from the dea uh, we have a license through the dea 
and then a lot of those amount of narcotics to train with for the dogs. You have to have a special license to have. All right, so let's hide some uh, drugs in here and see if the dog can find them. Absolutely. All right, let's do it. Stat, you want to oh, grab okay. one? Let's you see. Put one somewhere here. Just leave it in the jar. You want to put one. And in we'll that watch cabinet. where you hide it. Let's just watch put where. One in that cabinet. Okay. Let's see. Just sit it in there somewhere. Just set it yeah, right in here right with the electronics. Fine. Okay, so that's the one. Yeah, and we'll right. put the table in front of it. Oh, oh, oh sneaky. sneaky. Yeah. All right, Chelsea, where we'll are you? We'll put uh, one in one of them desk, uh, drawers. Sure. Any drawer, it doesn't matter. All right, Chelsea's hiding one. one in that drawer right there. All right. We're good okay, to go. let me one see. One more. Here, I'll take that one. And uh, do the window sill. Do the window sill yeah, over yeah. here? Okay, I will get that over here. And let's see. I'll just put that back there. You go. Yeah. Hide it behind there. Yeah, there we go. What's this dog's name? This dog's name is Onyx. Onyx. Yep. Winning, you ready? All right, no, no giving clues, Stat. Okay. I'll try not to look at it. Here we go. Oh, he's ready to do his job. They're getting him out. Onyx. My dog's name is Onyx as well. Okay, this is Onyx, huh? This is Onyx. The three-year-old German Shepherd. And you're officer Onyx. winning? Yes, sir. Bellsmere Police Department. And what kind of dog is Onyx? He's a three-year-old German Shepherd Belgian Malinois cross. All right, well, let's... Oh, wait, wait, don't go too fast. I got to get back in there as well. <laughs> He's hot. He's excited. So Onyx is ready. Let me get in. All right, Onyx. Ready to work. Onyx is on it. <laughs> you gotta find those drugs. Uh oh, it's hard to keep up. He's on to something. Oh, he went right to yours, Dave. Uh oh, what you got over there? You got something over there? <laughs> Onyx, there's two more to go, buddy. Here, you gotta drop the ball. He's working. Yeah, He's scanning the room. Here he comes. Here we go. All right. Uh, ready? Onyx, you ready? Back to work. You see him looking. Uh-oh. 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 Wait, you got something? Are you a little excited, I think? Well, he's looking. I don't think he's that guy's got some. Uh-uh. 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 He's on to something. And, oh, yep, oh, he's got he it. He knows it. It's right in there. Oh man. Look at that. Oh yeah. He What's in there? Cabinet. What's in there? It's in there. Wow, he is good. Look at him. Say open this for me. <laughs> uh oh. There we go. There we go. Let's get this out of there. Alright, there's two down. Two down. Onyx, you got two out of three so far. Go get him. No, you're cheating now. I'm curious because it's around food. If you yeah. uh, go, oh, oh. go for the. No, he won't go for the food. <laughs> He's looking. Search. Oh, 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 you're so, oh, you're getting colder. You're getting colder. That was already over there. <laughs> He's got that nose up. The... There's still residual odor from where it was. Yeah, yeah, you can still smell. Yeah, there's still residual odor in the air over there where it sat. It permeated the blinds for a second. Going back over there, yeah. There's another one. There's one more, Onyx, come on. Oh, there you go. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Next <laughs> here. Search. Oh, he got it. Yep. Look at that. Look at that. He's just on that second drawer, too. Isn't that something? You got it. Got the honey wheat bread. You got it right here. Oh, quit licking me. Right there! Congratulations! Ooh, don't, don't you eat them! <laughs> yeah, that was awesome! Wow, good boy! Three for three!
So you keep those uh, in locked boxes, I see. Uh, we have a safe that they stay in. They always stay inside of a safe, and then they stay in these airtight boxes. So, Officer right. Dooley, so what's going to happen now is We're Stat gonna... is putting on this jacket. He is. What, what is, is that made of? Um, really thick material, to be honest with you. Oh, I was hoping you'd say oh. Kevlar. How heavy no, is No, they're not Kevlar. They're it's very heavy. It's actually not as heavy as I thought. Or you'd like it to be, probably. But it's very thick. Maybe so, it should be heavier. Oh, my. Oh, gosh, that's thick. So yeah, but I could feel you grabbing, you too. Can. can you feel that? Yeah, yeah, <laughs> a little. Yeah? Hit it real hard. Give it a good you one. You want me to? Yeah, give it a good one right on my shoulder. Right here? Yeah. Oh, that's good. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Really I there? barely felt it. All right. All right, I'm all in. Sorry, Put wait, wait let's see. Inside. All right. You keep your hands inside into a fist. Oh, my dad used to hate that when your I did hands, this in church. Your hands into a fist. Okay. All right, your hands okay. are into a fist in there. Why yeah. is that? Why does he need to do that? Because well, I don't want him to grab his hands. Oh, okay, okay. okay. So that'll be a bad day. <laughs> <I'm okay. laughs> that'll be going to the hospital. Okay, I'll, I'll so bring your hands in. Are you okay. ready, Stat? I'm ready. So which onyx is coming in? The one that's it'll be, it, for the drugs? It'll, it'll the be my, my onyx. Okay, okay. so why? Like why let me ask you this. Is is Onyx when she sees or he sees that jacket? Is he trained to just attack it? Um, not necessarily, but he's gonna he associates that as a threat. Oh, okay. Um, from training and stuff, he associates that as a threat. Why so, I oughta? Please pull your hands up as far as they'll go. <laughs> All right, so when the dog comes in, and he's gonna come, so say Jesse's the dog, and I'm standing here. Okay, you're gonna want to show him the arm. Okay. Okay. Show him the arm when he comes in. You're gonna take the arm away. Oh, so you want him to? You want to right take here. the arm away. You want to catch the dog back here. Oh, okay. This is where the most padding is. If he gets you up here, you're gonna feel it a little bit. Okay. 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 You want to so catch I on wanna... the back? See the back of your triceps back here? That's feel all right. that padding right there. Ah. Okay. That's where you want him so to grab. Bring your okay. arm up across your body like this. There yeah. you go. Okay. Take the arm away. So now go. When, so you no, 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 And bring it across. When he bites on. When he bites on you, he's gonna he's gonna latch and he's not gonna let go until I tell him to. When I have him let go, go back to a dormant state and just stand still. Okay. Okay. And then we'll get him back. You're asking him to stand still. <laughs> All, right. All right. You don't have to worry about that. Okay, here I'm we go. I'm so nervous. Which arm are you putting out, Stan? I'm gonna put on my right one. Okay. Dave, should we move back here out of the way? Well, I need yeah. to. Am I gonna be taken down to the ground? I'm it going down. Before. Possibly. Oh boy. I'm going to stand back here. We would be doing this outside, but it's just so windy we couldn't hear anything. All right. Oh, I hear the dog a barking. Are you nervous? <laughs> Are you nervous, Dad? I'm super nervous. <laughs> you got I, your I hands look, clenched and pulled they're, up. They're hidden in there. Okay. Okay. Go and then and then. Oh, here he comes. Here he comes. Get ready. Okay. Oh boy. Oh, I'm nervous too. <laughs> He's at the door. Here we go. Oh boy. Oh, he's so excited. Why am I? Oh my god. Oh boy. Oh no. There we go. Is that fight back? Yeah, fight. Oh, come on. He's, he loves fighting. <laughs> Whoa. Be careful, Stan. Don't hurt the dog. Oh, he's got me. Oh, wow. Oh. Still, I'll bring him off. Okay. Stand still, stand still. Stand still. Oh, he's out here! Out here! Out here! 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 Nine! Here! Nine! Here! 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 You forgot to stand still. I'm so sorry to us, nervous. Blind. Good job. Good dog. Whoa! Blime. <laughs> Blime. 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 Ick Ben Ein Statman. Blime. You want me to send him again? Should we? It's up to you, Stat. Blime. He's really excited. Blime. I guess. Pocket. So. There you go. There you go. <laughs> wow! <laughs> How heavy is this dog? How heavy? 100 pounds. 100 pounds. Yeah. Pull him down. Don't wear me out. Uh, At least he's not Bring your arms up, stand still. Ice out here! 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 Nine here! Force. 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 Good boy. 
Now let me ask you this. Settle. No. Settle. Settle down. Good job. No. If uh, if you weren't wearing that very heavy, thick coat, that would really, really hurt. Oh, absolutely. And you would not. You would pretty much be in submission in about one second. Oh yeah. He, Officer Billy is going to show you what happens when you don't, you're not wearing your feet. Oh wait. Well, wait a minute. You got bit by. Him? Oh, my. Who did that? Another dog during training. Another dog? Oh, yikes. Stat, I think you better take that off. Yep. Stat, let's, let's get you undone here. I don't know. I can't do it with the camera. So, Stat, what did it feel like? It felt like I was getting pulled down by, like, a football player. Oh, he's so strong and heavy. But Are you wrong. hurting at all? Could you feel his teeth coming through? Oh, I could feel just a little bit, just the pressure. Yeah. It was like getting bit by a catfish. All the pressure and no teeth. Chelsea, you ready to put on the jacket? That would be a big in <laughs> That's what happens when Chelsea comes home every day to two Great Danes and a Golden Retriever officer winning. Oh, well, I believe it. Yeah, she, <laughs> she gets that thing. Well, guys, thank you so much. This was so much fun. And I loved meeting Onyx and Onyx. Onyx. Yep. And they did great. And uh, Officer Dooley, you're going to pop on with us to answer some questions here Absolutely. in just, just a couple of minutes. I'm sure the kids have a lot of them, <laughs> so you better be ready. All righty. Cool. Stat, good job. Do I get a treat? <laughs> <laughs>
like what was happening to Statman without the jacket on. Uh, unfortunately, sometimes that does happen. Mm -hmm. uh, let's see, Tyler would like to know, well, here's, let me get Katie's first here. Um, well, there's another one, Marissa. Okay, does Onyx only do commands in a different language? Uh, he knows a little bit of English. I mean, I can't tell him to sit or lay down because he doesn't know what that means. Uh, all his basic commands are German. In German. Uh, Katie would like to know, uh, or from Camden there in Katie's class, wants to know if a dog has ever turned on an officer. Um, the dogs sometimes will get aggressive towards us. Uh, they're pack animals. They're like wolves. Um, there's a leader. Uh, you know, we like to think that we're the alpha leader, and sometimes the dogs will become that they want to be the leader. So there, there's sometimes they do show a little aggression towards us, but we have to let them know that we're in charge. Tyler would like to know when, when the dog retires, can you keep it? Uh, yes, yes. When Onyx retires, he will become my dog. Become your dog. That's wonderful. And uh, Marissa would like to know, did any of Onyx's siblings become canine cops? Um, Officer Winnings, Onyx's, uh, a lot of his siblings became police canines. Um, my Onyx came from a working line um, over in Czech, Czech, the Czech Republic of German Schutzen dogs. So all of his siblings um, are in the line of the sport of Schutzen. Uh, German okay. Schutzen. We have so many questions. It's amazing here. Uh, Rita would like to know, uh, has Onyx helped make a drug bust? Uh, hundreds. Hundreds of, yeah. Uh, if you have drugs on you, the last thing you want to see is Onyx coming out of that car, I would imagine, because they're going to find, she's going to, he's going to find them immediately. How much does Onyx weigh? I think you said during, there was a lot of barking going on, but a hundred pounds. 95 to 100 pounds. Uh, we try to keep him. I, I really wish I could keep him at 90, but my wife gives him some snacks every now and then. <laughs> are the uh, Christian wants to know, are German Shepherds good family dogs? They are. They're the most loyal dog I've ever owned. And uh, Samantha would like to know, if you were wearing the jacket, would the dog bite you? Fiona, um, that question. He, yeah, he probably would if I told him to. Yeah, Okay. And uh, Amber would like to know, what does Onyx do for fun? Uh, he likes to play ball. He loves his ball. Uh, he likes to play ball. Um, in the summertime, he likes to hang out at the pool. I have a pool in my back. He likes to just lounge on the deck and sit in the sun. Yeah, like any dog. He loves when I grill. He likes when I cook out because he always thinks he gets a hot dog or a piece of a hamburger. <laughs> and I bet he does, doesn't he? He uh, does last, sometimes. Uh, let's see. Uh, Olivia wants to know, do you have any Rottweilers that are police dogs? Um, there is Rottweilers that are police dogs, but none here in northern Kentucky. Okay. And Diane would like to know, is it ex expensive to train these dogs? Um, the ex training can be very expensive. Um, sometimes to get a dog at the training level that we have, you'd be looking somewhere between, you know, twelve to $18,000, depending on okay. the breed of the dog. Samantha says, do police dogs have to be a certain kind of dog? Uh, no, there's all different kinds of dogs. Um, uh, Covington Police has a lab that they use that's very good. Uh, the airport police has some uh, German short-haired pointers that are drug-sniffing dogs that are absolutely amazing. Uh, Tyler would like to know, do you have any bloodhounds as dogs? Uh, we do not here, but certain some other agencies um, here across the United States have got bloodhounds. They're great tracking dogs. Okay. And uh, Diani want to know, do you guys train them yourselves? You actually, you continue their training, but like you said, their training is done mainly in a Czech, in the Czech Republic. Um, well, mine was done over there. Um, there's different places across the United States. You can get canines, uh, breeders and vendors that you can get police canines through. FM canine is one. Um, Shallow Creek Kennels is one, and uh, they have dogs, and they will start you through your training process to continue on. And I guess, uh, let's see. Uh, well, here's a good one. Diane, how long do these dogs usually serve before they retire? Uh, generally speaking, somewhere between seven to ten years, um, depending on the health of the dog is okay. what it all comes down to. Well, we really appreciate you uh, and, and Officer Winning uh, letting us meet both of your Onyx dogs today. And uh, it was a lot of fun, Officer Dooley. Thank you very Absolutely. much. Absolutely.
Hey, thank and, you guys for having us. Yeah, we loved it. And uh, I tell you what, it was a lot of fun. And I, I appreciate everybody hanging with us there uh, through the problems we were having. Let's check real fast on our stat man there over. He's still in Villa Hills where he lives, where we just were. And you're feeling good? Yes, all fine. No puncture marks, no <laughs> bruising, nothing. Oh, he heard, he heard my voice. Uh-oh. <laughs> 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 They're getting a little anxious. So uh, let's see. Chelsea, uh, did your dog, I know you were trying to stay muted when they heard the Onyx dogs barking. Were they barking at all behind you, your four dogs? They are actually sleeping upstairs right now. And somebody asked if they thought a Great Dane would make a, a – I was going to let you answer this question. Do you think a Great Dane, like you have two of them, would make a good police dog? Mm, too many naps. They take yeah. too many naps. They're a little bit lazy. All right. Yeah, just so big day. Somebody wants to say hi. Oh, we got somebody. Let me get over here. Let me find you. Oh, guys, this is a treat. Look at this. Hey. Hi. Say hi. Tell them hi. Oh, just, just such a beautiful dog. Thank you. Is everybody waving at Onyx now? Tell them hi. Thank you. Uh, Onyx and Officer Dooley for their services. <laughs> Mom might have some treats there for you, Officer Dooley. All right. All right. Well, thank you very much. And I tell you what, Ashley, I wanted to get with Ashley here real fast. You didn't get to go on this field trip with us, but you're really looking forward to the one we're going on next Wednesday. Can you let everybody know what we're going to be doing? We're going to the zoo. Yep. And, and we're going to see some what? Zoo, zoo babies. Zoo babies, oh yeah, it's that time of the year. Zoo babies, so make sure you go sign up. Our, our Cincinnati Zoo and Botanical Gardens uh, will be paying them a visit as well. So uh, thank you guys for all uh, being here with us today and thanks for having patience. Uh, I should know better than to do a, uh, an update on my iMac here, on my Mac and not think, oh, well, it's gonna mess everything up. I take, yeah, I just think it's gonna work. So. Uh, we got the kinks all out. Thank you, guys. Thanks to Skyline Chili, Griffo's Potato Chips, and Hawksworth Blood Center for sponsoring our fun. And uh, make sure you go to our B105 Cincinnati YouTube channel because you can see every single one of our Big Dave Show virtual field trips and show them to your class or just watch them at your leisure. So uh, thank you guys very much, and bye-bye. Uh, we'll see you next Wednesday at the Cincinnati <laughs> Zoo. Hi, right, bye, everybody. Let me go through and see everybody that's waving. Bye. Bye, Marissa. Bye, Diane. Bye, Miss Mary's Kate. Mary. I can't get over there going too fast. Well, thank you, guys. Have a great one.